initiated the stop northbound on Garth, just south of Rolling Brook. He turned into 1300 and went west on Rolling Brook. I saw it was occupied two times. There's a white passenger. Couldn't see the road. 97, what's the color again? I'm going to get up on 330. 95, it's a dark blue, newer model, Ford Mustang, white racing stripes. Did he definitely stay off? Definitely did not get on 330. He did not come down there hard. 95, I'm going down Decker past Texas. 95, can we get a unit to check northbound on Decker from Earhart, see if he made a U-turn? He did, and I was on that side. I'm down here with waiting. Whenever you said he went down Earhart, I was actually right there on the other side in the entrance ramp of, uh, of 330. So he didn't make a U-turn. And this press release from Lieutenant Steve Dorse with the Baytown Police Department. On March 28th at 2.50 a.m., officers attempted to conduct a traffic stop on a blue Mustang. The vehicle initially pulled into a parking lot in the 1300 block of Rolling Brook. However, the vehicle suddenly accelerated and fled out of the parking lot and west on Rolling Brook. Officers pursued the vehicle as it turned onto Decker Drive and headed south. As the vehicle approached Earhart and Decker, officers lost sight of the vehicle. During this time, officers learned through dispatch that the vehicle returned as a stolen vehicle. The car was stolen on the 24th. If he's still in this city, he must live here. Officers saturated the area and began looking for the stolen vehicle, which was suddenly located in the parking lot of the Brixton Apartments in the 1600 block of Garth Road, unoccupied. 168 to 79 or 155 to 20, I want to come up here and take pictures of the vehicle. 97, I'm in here. I'll take them. Officers recovered the vehicle as stolen and contacted the registered owner to advise them of the recovery. There are no charges at this time, nor is there any suspect information.